Hi viewers, today I'm going to do something a little bit different with the Kaiser Craft Frosted series. I'm going to take a mask this time and I'm just going to pop it over a tag that I have covered with some pattern paper and just tape this down to my desk or work surface temporarily while I stencil on a design. <clears throat> For this I'm going to be using some glitter paste. So with my tool I'm just going to carefully run some of that glitter paste over the stencil. Not pressing too hard, I don't want any to get in under the stencil. So just scrape lightly down across all parts of that before lifting it gently up. I'm going to dry this with my heat tool and then come back into camera once it's done. So I'm just about there. When you pull it up and you can see the design is there. It's quite wet but I'm going to dry that off. I'm going to take my Brilliance ink pad. This is the platinum one. I'm just going to ink around the edges of this tag just to darken it up a little bit. So I've got a rub of ink. And then I've got lots of washi tape that I wanted to use for this one. So I've taken some of my glitter washi tape. I'm going to put two strips down the bottom and then I'm going to take some Christmassy designed washi tape that I've had for ages and just attach that as well across those two uh, middle glitter pieces just to make a Christmas band. From the frosted kit I'm going to take one of the tags and just mount that tag on using some double sided tape. Best day of the year, the 25th. And that will just go down in the bottom right hand corner. <clears throat> and once I have that tag down with some double sided tape, I'm then going to take another few of the elements from the embellished collection, which are the little snowflakes. I'm just going to arrange those on top of the tag randomly. And once I'm happy with the placement, I'm just going to use a dimensional piece of tape to glue those down. The last thing I need to do is put a bit of ribbon on. I have some pom-pom ribbon again that I've had for ages. I'm trying to use up a bit of my stash here. So I'm just going to poke through part of that and then I will tape it at the back again like I did with one of my other tags. And using just some normal ribbon I'm just going to tie around the top on the front of the tag. I was going to put it at the back but I changed my mind and just tied it around the front. Found, it, found that was easier. And then just snip off the edges. And there you have tag number four. A little bit more colourful today. Thanks for watching. Don't forget there's a giveaway which will be announced at the beginning of the seventh tag. You can go check my blog out for more information. You can find me on Facebook. Interest, and if you like these videos, please subscribe. Thanks for watching.